Hi and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. If you are new and you like makeup, beauty, hair or hauls then please consider subscribing. So Beauty Bay have released a new selection of eyeshadow palettes, absolutely stunning. There is the Midnight one, the Earthy one, and then the one that I cannot remember the name of. It's um, it's like a, a pinky, purpley, plummy toned one. I'll probably remember as the video goes on and blurt it out at some point. But I picked up the Midnight and the Earthy. Now these come in a small, I think it's a, a nine pan palette. <clears throat> they also come in these ones which are 16 pans and then there's the large I'm not sure how many there are possibly 32 pans um but I picked up the middle one in both so today I'm going to be testing out the midnight one tomorrow I'll review the earthy one <clears throat> you have to excuse me today I've, I've woken up with a bit of a sore throat and my voice keeps breaking now I have to admit, when I looked at the colour story of these on the website, I thought that this being the Midnight one reminded me of the Age of Opulence palette, which I do have, absolutely love that. The Earthy one reminds me of the Wilderness one, and the other one that I cannot remember the name of reminds me of the uh, Romantic palette. I do actually have all three of those. The sort of pinky, reddy toned palette I didn't get because it actually reminded me a little bit too much of the, the new Romantic palette. but I, I I can't help myself when, when they bring out palettes with blues and greens because I absolutely love those colours. So I did pick up these two. So this is the packaging of the Midnight palette itself. Really nice, just simple, basic design. You know, you don't really need any more than that. And then this is the colour story. So it's very, very pretty. We've obviously got a clear divide of blues and purples here. And as you can see, a really nice ratio of mattes to shimmers in there as well. So I'll give these a quick swatch. OK, so here's the first slot. There was just the bottom row that I couldn't get on, so I'll do that separately. We have lavender, tranquil, jellies, catch, voodoo, gleam, iris, electric, sky, that's, that's gorgeous, uh, denim, bubbles, and mist and then these are the last four which are cerulean steel hex and potion yeah so i think they look absolutely stunning so let's get stuck in so i think i'm going to start off by using the color mist which is this really pale blue just here and i'm going to kind of use that to set my uh my primer so i'm going to go all, all over my crease and kind of just, just blend it out. So it's just like a bit of a wash of colour, really. Right, okay, so like that. Look how beautifully that has blended. Really, really lovely. And yeah, it's not really a wash of colour. It's it's actually for a pastel, it's really pigmented. So yeah, I may have to go a slightly different route to what was planned, but saying that, I absolutely love this colour. So, you know, I don't mind. So next I'm gonna go back into my crease again, but concentrating more on the actual crease itself using don't know whether to go for iris or voodoo so it's these two kind of i think i might go for this one actually so iris Yeah, that's really pretty. I'm just going back in and just blending it out again with the brush that I used before. Yeah, 
that's better I'm happy with that okay so then next I think what I'm going to use is the other pair plus said about so voodoo which is this really gorgeous dark shade I'm going to use that on the outer part just here Right, okay, so then on the this part just here, I'm going on with a shimmer and I want to go on with, I think I'm going to choose Gleam, which is this really quite sort of pale blue shimmer just here. Actually, it's kind of like in between blue and purple, which is kind of why I want to use this one. Very pretty, isn't it? Very nice. Yeah, that is so pretty. Really, really like that one. Yeah, I'm really, really happy with that. I think that's stunning. It's kind of, it looks blue. I don't know if it does on, yeah, it does. It looks blue in the shadow palette. On the eye, it kind of looks more purple. I think it might be like um, a, a duochrome, like a colour shift one. Right, so underneath, I'm going to go in with voodoo just on the very outer bit here to connect it and then i am going to smoke it out using well not smoke it out kind of blend it out i should say using mist which was the really pale blue that i used first Okay. Oh, I'm loving this. Absolutely loving it. Right. So inner corners and brow bone. Um, there's not really a, a colour that I would use on my brow bone. Inner corners, I suppose I could use a, a little pot of colour maybe, but I'm not going to because I don't want to spoil it. I'm just going to go on with my normal highlighter, I think. Yeah. So right, we're pretty much done. So I'm just going to go and do my lashes. As I just said, in the corners, brow bone highlighter and some some lipstick. Yeah, and I'll be back. And here is the finished look. I love this palette. Absolutely love it. Do you know what? I had high hopes anyway. It's a Beauty Bay palette. And, and to be honest, I still to this day have never found a, a bad one. The colour story. Yeah, really, really nice. It is quite similar to Age of Opulence, if I'm being honest. But there are, you know, there are differences and you cannot fault the formula. It is absolutely beautiful. It really is. I am so happy with this look. It blended really easily, effortlessly, you know, on some colours. The, the first colour that I used to, you know, place down as my as my transition shade was it, it just literally went on without any effort at all. Yeah, it was almost like it, it did the work for me, to be honest. 
so yeah and, and the shimmer was stunning yeah love it absolutely love it i can't wait to dig into the other one now so here you go here's a quick close-up of the eyes yeah i think it's really nice absolutely love this shimmer i wasn't expecting it to be that color because as i said it looks blue in the in the eyeshadow palette and when you put it on obviously because i've got more purple than blue on my eyes i think it kind of went more of a, a purple shade but that's that's absolutely fine by me i think it looks gorgeous really really pretty color so yeah if you want to check the palette out for yourself then i'll leave the link in the description box below for you and as i say tomorrow i will be reviewing the earthy palette which will go up tomorrow night i don't know around six ish maybe so yeah keep an eye out for that one as well so i hope you enjoyed watching and if you did please give me a thumbs up and i'd really appreciate it it'd mean the absolute world to me if you did enjoy watching this video and you would like to see more content from me in the future and you would like to subscribe to my channel until then, thanks for watching. Bye! I'm thinking you were made for me Isn't it my birthday yet? Cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby